Lunarly. You're just a little lunarly. No one could ever change your lunarly face. I don't think she's not like have a round face like the moon. <laughs> your face is like the moon. Round and full of pits. <laughs> You're the pit. We got like a purple spot. Yeah. everybody welcome back to box pop and beauty i'm kendall i'm michael and today we're doing lunarly lunarly we got the plant last month so this month will probably be a candle mm -hmm. and we don't know what else i don't know what moon we're in so it's a surprise it's 50 dollars a month and it goes with the cycles of the moon so you get stuff that corresponds with whatever moon cycle you're in it's a pretty cool box See how my intros are just short and sweet, and you just go on and on and on? Yeah. It's because your stuff, there's not much to talk about. That's not true. Okay, here's this, and here's the candles. They do a really great job on their packaging. Yeah, so the candle's in a little thing like this. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure the scent is always the same of these candles. Really? I'm pretty sure. I don't think so. Maybe not actually, this smells different. Yeah, I don't think they're always the same. That smells like cinnamon. Or... So this says October, yeah, cause this is the October Lunarly. I think this might be the same. Yeah, that's definitely the same. But the scent is always, this is like almost like a pumpkin spice. Yeah, it smells really good. I wish you guys could smell it. Smell guys. Everybody lean forward and take a big sip. Good job. All right, hopefully you guys didn't toot right before that. And inside of here, we got boom. All right, so I get these things. Kendall takes care of the box. We'll go over this first, though. It is the Blue Moon. Great beer. That's actually a beer that I like. Um, Blue Moon, so the new moon will be October 16th. The first quarter moon will be October 23rd, and the full moon will be October 31st. I think this is super rare, right? October had two, two full, full moons. moons. That's, yeah. like, super rare. Um, get ready, because once in a blue moon is happening right now. Oh! Oh, mm -hmm. is that really why this is the blue moon? Because it only happens once in a while? Like, I don't know. So normally it's not blue moon. Blue moons occur when there is more than one full moon in a month. Who knew? Cool. Now we know, everybody, you're welcome. Now you know what once in a blue moon means. Now you can be that impressive person at yeah. a party who can... That makes this especially potent time for setting intentions. Welcome the power it brings and your efforts will be rewarded. An intention to inspire. I am powerful. I can do what I set my mind to. I wonder, like, not only is it once in a blue moon, but it's happening on All Hallows' Eve. So you've got, like, a super spiritual day in history with a blue moon, full moon. Yeah, we're going to have to do some We're making, like, outside. I'm making, like, gallons of moon water. Yeah. <laughs> I see something in here that's really exciting, but I'm not going to go for that first. I'm making gallons and gallons of moon water. I'm going to make moon... Moon tea. That's a great idea. I wonder if it would work. All right. Okay, so this is Joy Wellness Spray. Uh, shake well before and during use. Mist above head and inhale deeply through the nose. Use on pillows and linens. Ideal for office, car, or airplane. Kendall loves pillow sprays. Hmm. Did you shake it? it? Smells pretty good. You didn't shake it. It literally says shake and you didn't even shake it. That's nice. Uh, so this says, sometimes happiness finds us and sometimes we seek it out on the days when you... It's going to make me sneeze. Look at light. Nope, didn't work. All right. On the days when you need an extra boost, reach for this bottle of joy filled with energizing scents of Lang Lang, lemon, and tangerine. A spritz of this spray is sure to perk you up. Use a spray in your environment to fill the space with stimulating aromas. Spray directly into pillow linen, pillows, linens, in your office or wherever you need a lift. It is energy. It's nice. Yeah, it is really nice. Okay, next up. All right, the next is going to be a stone. I don't know what that is. I do know what it is, but I can't place it at the moment. It looks like, I believe it's raw and it's red jasper. So it's not polished. Okay. Which Kendall loves unpolished stones. So red jasper is ready to be your rock. Okay, obviously it's already a rock, but as a stone known for offering a sense of stability, Red Jasper can be a source of comforting support. Connect to this stone when you need to feel grounded. 
and it says, find a seated position on the ground, holding the red jasper in your hand, which is supposed to hold in your right hand, right? No, your left. That's the left one hand. that goes to your heart. Okay. So holding your left hand, as you breathe in and out, visualize your root chakra becoming one with the earth. Allow yourself to feel stronger and more balanced in your foundation. So it's a root chakra. Okay. Okay. This I'm really excited about. This is a pendulum. Oh boy, here we go. And I ordered two of these already, but you can never have... We got a broken one. Enough. We got one that worked and we got a broken one. So, did we ever, like, reset it? No. Oh, that's cool that it's got a chakra stones on the... Yeah, so it's all a the really stones pretty pendulum. on it are... So it's got chakra, chakra stones colors. down there and then it's got a pendulum. So this is... It's called a six-sided seven chakra tiger's eye pendulum. A pendulum is an ancient tool used to connect with your spirit and guides. Usually those working with the pendulum would think of a question stated out loud and wait for the pendulum to swing yes or no depending on the direction. Hold the chain between your thumb and index finger. Allow the tiger's eye pendulum to hang centered above the surface of your pendulum mat. State your questions out loud and wait for the pendulum to swing. This is cool because we don't have a pendulum mat. No, so this is the pendulum mat. It kind of is like a um, Ouija board for pendulums, which, not gonna lie, creeps me out a little bit, but. But this is something that I will use. Yeah, this is great. Because we've had, really we nice. have pendulums, it's, we just didn't have pendulum mats. It's velvet. I didn't even know pendulum mat was a thing. So I don't know how to use like the outside. I'm sure it'll the tell days, you. But I know how to use yes, no, maybe. So this says the velvet pendulum mat has all the answers. You just need to ask the questions. The mat includes response options like yes, no, maybe, numbers, days, and astrological signs. Hanging the pendulum centered above the mat, take a few calming breaths and begin to ask your questions. That's really cool. Yeah, this is neat. This is something that I wanted but wasn't going to order for myself. I didn't know you wanted a pendulum mat. Yeah. Yeah, I knew you. We have, this will be her third pendulum. Like I said, we got one that was a little off. Um, we asked some questions that we knew the answers to and it, it did not swing correctly. So um, I think we, what, what do we do? We soaked it in salt. Yeah, we'll charge it under the moon. Yeah. Um, so, and then the blue moon candle is called Surrender and Embrace. Uh, the scents are coffee, cinnamon, and cardamom. So you kind of got like a coffee, a pumpkin spice latte. Yeah, it's really good. Um, allow the spice notes of this warm and inviting candle to invoke your passions. The cinnamon scent is meant to foster a feeling of safety, while the coffee bean aroma implores you to seize the day. Light it, take a deep breath, and ask yourself what you're ready to change. Before writing down your intention this month, make sure to light this candle first. Let its invigorating scent inspire you. Then, when you're ready, write your intention on a slip of paper and set it beneath the candle. Each time you light the candle, think about how you can succeed in your intention. Close your eyes and visualize yourself sitting on the beach, gazing up at the moon, hanging just over the horizon. Hear the gentle waves, see the twinkling ripples on the water, and recognize how safe you are in this still moment. I feel like this is like the second or third time that uh, Lunarly has asked us to meditate believing we are at the ocean. Now, while that works for me, it's terrible for her. Yeah, I don't ever do that. <laughs> I have I go to um, a thing called neurofeedback, which is, if you want to know what it is, you can look it up, but it's a type of therapy. And um, she always wants to put this ocean scene on for me to help me relax. And I'm always like, please don't. That gives me so much anxiety. If Kendall sees the ocean, she just is like waiting for that moment that she's going to see a shark go by. Like no matter I'm where really she is. I'm really waiting for a major tsunami to throw a shark onto me. Like just, ow. That's it. And they will fall mouth first because that's the heaviest part She of believes them. in Sharknado. It could happen. I really could. Think about it. <laughs> anyway. That's it for this Lunarly box. We hope you enjoyed it. This was awesome. Um, I don't think that there's anything in here that we won't keep. Kendall does have red jasper, but I don't think that she has an unpolished red jasper. I don't think I'll keep this stone, actually. You're not? No. I have too many crystals right now. Is your thing full? No, but I'm not really... In this doesn't resonate with me. I'm not really interested. I'm surprised. I figured it's you'd keep it because most that. of the red jasper is, like, polished. Yeah. No, probably not. Okay. Well, I'm wrong. But anyway, other than that, though, the pendulum and the pendulum mat is right up her alley. Yeah, we'll be using this for sure. So, anyway, and the, she loves candles and pillow sprays. Yeah. Even though I don't know about using a energizing pillow spray. Yeah, I'll probably put it in my car or something. 
Yeah, this would be great for cars, offices, workspaces, you know. Anyway, that's it. We'll see you guys next month for the next Lunarly. Bye. Once in a blue moon, now you know what it means.